Hello, hello everybody and welcome to a brand new series of Crash Tag Team Racing. I have already done Crash Team Racing on the channel, of course that was made by Naughty Dog. This game, however, was made by the people that made Simpsons Hit and Run, so... Which I also did on this channel, so I don't, uh... I don't know if you guys are gonna like it, but I definitely have a lot of good memories of this game. And most of it isn't from the racing. The racing in this game is subpar at best. To be honest, I don't even know if I'm going to record any races for you guys. But something interesting about this game, just like in, um, uh, just like in, uh, what's it called, uh, Simpsons Hidden Run, is that there's an open world to it, but with Crash. So an open world Crash game is still hidden in this game, and there's a lot of little mini games that we can try out that you guys might enjoy. So that's what we're going to do. But first we got to get into the story, you know how it is. See how Crash has been doing. We'll see how it goes. Oh, what the fuck? Oh yeah, I forgot. In this old game, you can mess with the loading screens by pressing X and triangle. Triangle will give you the sound of somebody shitting. X will give you the sound of what the fuck. Top of the morning and the yeah, top of the morning, you buddy. Sports fans. Chick Gizzard lips here, What's up, welcoming Gizzard? Welcoming you to the farewell race at Von Clutch's Motor World. Farewell. That's right, Chick Baby, on what might be the final day of operation. You got some nice hair there, buddy. Clutch will surely have to turn out the lights on his lifelong dream. Bon Clutch, the deranged genius cyborg, has fabricated the ultimate auto racing theme park. Indeed, the park's tracks have wreaked terror on its participants. Too gruesome oh, what for the this fuck? reporter to describe yeah, he's got a reporter over hat the now. air. Well, I ain't got a problem hat. with it. Man, you ever put a big ham in a wood chipper? I know I Where have. the fuck would you do that? <clears throat> oh, sorry. But now old Bon Clutch's power gems have been stolen. Giving Von Clutch just a few hours to get his power gems back. Oh, it's slam dunk. Oh, what the? Thank you, pump. Okay, Ebenezer never mind. This third Clutch hairstyle is, is your best one yet. That's good. The pump door was pretty cool. Not pump door. The freaking, uh, the flip race. hair was pretty good, too. Contestants must survive a gauntlet of each of the park's five lands. Ooh, five and lands. cover every one of the power gems that have been stolen. Power gems instead of crystals. And there they are, people. Our heroes. And villains. Oh shit, they brought crunch. This story has crunch. But yeah, this game isn't made by Naughty Dog people, but only the original four are. Um, so... Don't expect the greatest quality from this game, but... I, I mean, they tried. The racing's just kind of whatever. It's too... It has too many exploits, and the weapons aren't exactly balanced. But you know what? They got the characters down. You gotta love them for that. I have only a short time left before I am Kaputsky. We must you know what this guy reminds me of? He He's looks like that bean enemy from freaking Mario Superstar Saga. The Mario and Luigi Superstar time. Saga. The first be enemy you find in the game, the beanies. That's what he looks like. If I can get a picture of it, And now he's a Copacabana chicken. Well, sports fans, it appears we found our donkers. Oh boy, we got racers now. And look at that, everybody! We're in a platforming game, and this tutorial should remind you of Simpsons Hidden Run pretty hard. So we're gonna get rid of that. Plus, I think they used a lot of assets from Simpsons Hidden Run, so get ready to hear similar sound effects. Like coins. The coins sound exactly the same. If you don't believe me, look at my... I think it was like my third Let's Play on this channel was Simpsons Hidden Run, so... Go into the playlist, go deep into the playlist, and you'll be able to find it. This game is a lot of, just like in Simpsons Hidden Run, it's about collecting money so that you can unlock new areas, new vehicles, and stuff like that. So please, make sure you get as many coins as possible. Even though it could be tedious at times, it is important that you collect that money. Plus, this is just like an old Crash game, so it does feel kind of good to move around. But, the, well, okay, it feels like an old Crash game except in the, okay, except in the controls department, which means... Which would mean it doesn't feel like an old Crash game, but you know what? Yeah, it feels like an old Crash game when you press the buttons. It doesn't feel like it when you try to do what you used to be able to do. So the problem is, Crash has like zero control in this game. He is way too fly, uh, floaty. He can do way too much stuff. In Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, and 3, he, had, he was way tighter. He was way heavier. He had some weight to him. In this game, he just flies around because uh, I don't think they, know, they knew how to uh, program a platforming game. Since it's hidden run should should have been a good example of that. But this game is supposed to be a racing game, so I guess I can't blame them too much. That's probably what they thought. They're like, we want to make a, cr a crash platforming game, but we suck at making platformers. Oh, then we'll just make a racing game, but half the game is still platforming, and then half the game will be racing. Oh, but we don't know how to program racing either. Did, did you see Simpsons Hidden Run? 
yeah, but kids love this shit. And they were right. I love this shit. I ended up buying this game, and I did enjoy it as a kid. I still kind of enjoy it now. Nowhere near as much as when I was a kid, but you know what? What are you going to do, guys? It's not their fault that times have changed and games get outdated. This is Crash Team Ra Tag Team Racing. Its whole gimmick is that you could fuse cars in this game and have a shooter and a driver, just like Mario Kart Double Dash. So, you know, they stole more ideas. I have all your games. <laughs> oh, he's a fan. No, you still look I like that bean. You're so ugly. Clutch, but I love your I voice, my though. Favorite video heroes. My dinner's tingle with joy. Well, tingle all you want. Cortex, you sound pretty good. I have an appointment with world domination. <laughs> I need more races to recover my power gems. Whoever is first to bring all the power gems wins the ownership of my bark. And look. Even my beloved black power gem is gone. Perhaps this is the answer to our dilemma. This deranged theme park is fertile ground for us to plant a new seed of evil. Uh, never yes. change engine. I love how crazy engine gets. He gets crazier in every game. Like whoever takes the crash license, just like, what if we get engine but make him even crazy? What the fuck? I'm racing for old Von Clutch, and I'm gonna whoop you, that's You don't know how to sure. apply lipstick. So, if I win, you'll hand over the deed to this amusement enterprise? No questions asked? Perhaps a riddle oh, or two! Oh, no. Holy cannoli! I am sorry, people. That if thing? that thing creeps you out, you are oh, a proper human Tony being. Captain if that thing is, turns you on, then Wumpa Jesus cheeks. Christ, I don't know what's wrong. Oh, my God! Don't give a close-up on it. That's disgusting. Okay, Von Clutch, we're in. Where do we start? Hi -li -ho. To the statue you must go. This way or that, fall down, you go splat! And everyone thinks you're a schmo. <laughs> Alright, so everyone just agrees to race because they want to own the park. Whoever wins all the races gets all the gems, gets to own the park. We still have that times two drink in effect, so I'm going to collect as many coins as possible. Uh, my controls are broken there. Whoa. Oh. I don't know why, but all my controls are reversed right now. And now they're back to normal. Okay. Look, we can see all the lions. We can go to Tyrannosaurus Rex, Astroland. No, I want to see it more. Oh. Uh, we can go to Astroland. We can go to Happily Ever After. Oh, we got it. This game is known for having a lot of gags, a lot of death animations, and for having some of the most ugly characters ever. This is your first ugly character, but look what they let you do to him. And you can do this as much as you want. Like, they can't fight back. This is just for your amusement. And yes, you can do other crap to him if you wanted to. You just have to... You just have to believe in yourself. So let's uh, go over here. And let's go over here. Oh, damn it. Ugh. All right, whatever. Let's ignore him. I'm going to go over here and show you guys this lady. Can I get a close-up on you, lady? I want to... No, no. I want to show people how you look. Look at that. Isn't that appropriate for... 2004, five standards? No, it's not. Take this, bitch. Ugh. There oh, we go. Okay, sure. I didn't need that <laughs> this game lets you look at kids. Fuck with them. Doesn't matter. Hey, uh, I don't know what the fuck you are. Give me that ice cream. Oh, okay. that sucks. You, no, I love messing around in this game, guys. You can do whatever the fuck you want. You see a little kid, you hit a little kid. What bam? And you can hear them cry, so that's that's the good part. Look at that. You don't even have to leave them alone. You can just keep them. You can combo them to death. No, sadly, uh, they have no uh, health bars. They will live forever. What the fuck is going on over there? Let me get a close... Well, nope, they fixed themselves. Okay, so this game is really buggy because it was poorly made. It's made by the guys that made Sense and Sin run for Christ, Christ's sake. So this is where we're supposed to go. We're supposed to go to Mystery Island. Of course, I'm not going to do that. What we're going to do instead is we're going to talk to Coco. Oh, Crash, thank goodness you're here. I've been trying to get this car working, but that stupid know-it-all know-nothing Nina stole my fusion unit. You've got to get it back for me. This car will be the this best This is literally just ever. Simpsons Hidden Run. And stop. Oh my gosh. This game is just Simpsons Hidden Run. They, they got know. the crash license, and that's all they did was make it Simpsons. Oh, Crash. Yes, Mr. Crash. You Mr. are reasonable, aren't you? You like to listen to propositions from Engine. I need a plutonium fuel cell for my new vehicle. Find me enough beautiful plutonium, and I will reward you with many fine coins. Uh, I like Engine. He's cool. Now let me just, uh, yeah, kill everyone that's freaking crowding Engine, the genius, the mastermind. 
Alright, let's take all this money, guys. We need to get money for uh, vehicles and such. And look at that! Holy shit! That is one of many dioramas. Dioramas are ways you can get yourself killed. Uh, in this game, there are specific points where you can kill yourself if you press square or triangle on them. And uh, if you find them all, you get little fun little movies, so they're kind of cool. I might try to get as many as possible. Oh, hey, cutie. You ever seen me driving on those tracks there? Boy, I tell you, I am the meanest thing on the streets. And if you thought that was something, wait till you see me driving this hog around. Trouble is, I need me a power crystal to get her started. You don't got one, do you? All right, Pasadena, we got to get you a power crystal. That's what I'm doing right now, guys. I'm getting everybody side quests. That way, if I happen to collect the item they need or if I do the thing to get the thing, to make the thing work, then, you know, I'm already done. So let's get all of this money. Get all the money you can right now because I have the times two effect, uh, in effect. So everything I collect, I get two of rather than one. Uh, Crunch, can you talk? Crash. What's up, little brother? Oh, what's up, Mr. T? Yeah, I'm at it. Enough jibber jabber. I need help. I found a ride that needs driving. You gonna help me? We bring the hurt. Eat your greens. Float old crunch alone. Low interest. I buy that ride and word. We bounce. Yes. Whatever you just said, I'm gonna help you accomplish. All right. So let's get as much money as possible. Uh, I think I wasted all my double time with uh, that. So we'll see. Oh, cool. A triangle. <laughs> Better, better. Uh huh. O okay. Interesting. Good, good, good. Glad to see what the creators of this game were into. No, I don't. I, never mind. I'm not. What? What the fuck are you doing over here? What? She keeps hitting me. No. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. I have to do it. The game lets you do it. All right. Okay. Now that I'm done with that, I'm gonna go continue the story mode. I'm, it's so much fun to hurt people. I love it. So where's the next victim? Who's who's kind of who's walking around innocently? All right. What else can we do in this area? I know. I know. It's like Jacob or Cooper. Why aren't you getting to your first race? Jacob works too. Uh, it's because I want to play around the area. I don't even care about racing in this game. That's the worst part of this game is the racing. The best part is everything else, like this. Yeah, more death. And that diorama, we collected number five, Mechanic Monday. Heck yeah. So, look around the map, guys. Let me know if I miss any deaths, but just look for interactables. If you see something that seems interactable, like this chicken, take this. Oh, that doesn't work. What about Mr. Cool Hair Chicken? Oh, that is one. Oh, you okay? Whoa, whoa! He just kicked our ass. Holy shit. I love it. Alright, so don't hit that chicken or you're going to get death animation. Well, hit him once so you can get the death animation, but don't hit him too many times. You don't want to get actually killed. That would be a problem. No, there are no lives in this game, guys. It's just collect the items. It's just it's just like Simpsons Hidden Run, except with way more minigames. Way creepier looking characters. At least Simpsons characters look kind of normal because we're used to them. But these characters, not so much. They kind of disturb us. Or at least me. If you guys are into what these characters look like, then... Jesus Christ, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? You guys are creepy as hell. But for me, oh, crap, 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 crap! No, that's not a death animation. That's just a boring death where they black out and then you come back to life. You want a cool death animation, you need a diorama. The diorama's the best. But right now, while I'm collect while I have the timer going, I'm or the time's two going, I'm going to collect as many coins as possible. Hey, there's Mr. Von Clutch. I'll talk to you in a second, Mr. Von Clutch. I want to hear your, your hear your dialogue. I love what you got to say. And whoa, let's jump over that. And let's do this, 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 this. Jump over that. And Von Clutch, what's up? Ah, Crash Bandicoot. You're admiring my beautiful automark, are ya? I can't. You have it so hidden under a ribbon and pink make cloth. I would my life if I could. <laughs> Please, Crash, bring me my power crystals that I may make this beautiful creature come to life. Yes, sir, Mr. Von Clutch. All right, so what you need to do is if you help out these people, this will uh, help, uh, uh, unlock vehicles for you in the uh, future for multiplayer. Now, there is multiplayer in this game, two-player mode, racing stuff, and uh, mini-game stuff, which is pretty cool. I used to play it with my friend Fernando. We used to do it quite a bit, actually. The stunt mode in this game is pretty damn fun, so when we get to it, I'll show it off. But today's episode, I don't plan on getting to the stunt mode. Today's episode, I plan on doing other oh, things. It's you, Hairball. 
Well, while I'm here, why don't you listen to a little proposition? All right, Nina. You bandicoots have a thing for power crystals, right? You bring me the keys to this mean machine Von Clutch is parked here, and I'll give you this crystal I found. All right. Find keys and give them to Nina. So King Nina needs... Everybody needs something. But we collected all the side missions, I believe. So, so now all we have to do is get the fuck away from these people. If you haven't noticed, if you get next to an AI, they actually start to come at you like freaking zombies. So let's do this minigame, which is by far the best minigame in the entire game. Von Clutch's Lanes. So in episode one, I'm already going to do the... Well, the second best minigame. There are two different bowling alleys in Von Clutch's place. And the bowling alleys are fun as hell because you're bowling penguins on super messed up tracks. So let's do some bowling. Uh, you can control your power and you can move your ball. You can curve your ball. You can do a bunch of stuff to your ball to make while it's moving with the analog stick. Uh, maybe in the future, if I can get my friends into this game just a little bit, of course, I would never make them do the racing, but if they'd be willing to do the bowling, I might, you know, get them on for an episode or something. We'll do some bowling together. We do in real life like every week, so we might as well. Ah, oh, damn you. It's not number five, but it's one of them jerk penguins. So, oh yeah, and in this game, uh, bowling, you get three frames to hit all the pins. If you do it in, t if you knock them all down in two, it's a spare. If you knock them all down in three, then you just get the ten points. So, that's what it is. The reason they give you three is because, look, this game has a lot of obstacles during the bowling. The obstacles can get kind of annoying, but just try your best, guys. It shouldn't be that bad. Uh, you can kind of control where your ball goes, though it's kind of difficult when you go fast. The less speed you have, the more control you have, but if you don't go fast enough, you can't really go off of these ramps and stuff. So it makes it kind of difficult. Plus, once you pick your, or once you press X, you're stuck in it. You cannot fix your angles or anything. Once you press X, you're kind of screwed. All right, I missed both of those, but if I can get all of these, then that doesn't matter. I did not get all of them, damn it. I need to get another spare, guys. I need to break 150. If I break 150, then I will get a crystal. Which is something we need for uh, Pasadena, I believe. So let's get that. Fuck me. <laughs> I was so close. All right. So this time I'm going to be serious. I'm going to get that thing. Uh, we're only going to be able to get 10 points here. We already messed up the spare. And yeah, I barely tapped it, but it went down. So the penguin is ours. All right. These are going to start getting harder. As you can see, that is a gutter. If you fall in there, you gutter. It sucks. You lose. You don't get any points, but that's how it is. And let's see it. Bam! We got a strike, people. Uh, you guys should notice that you only actually have five variations of, of uh, fields because there's ten frames, but there's only but you have to do the same frame twice. So yeah, there's two, but there's two different bowling alleys in this game. So there's technically a, a total of ten different uh, different kinds of you know setups. Different types of pins. Oh, whoa! It came back and hit those other two. What the heck? That's freaking awesome. All right, let's do this. Bounce, bounce. Wait, why, how come that one didn't fall? Oh, I got the spare. That was freaking awesome. All right, now we're starting to get into road hazards. I don't like these. All right, let's do this and into this. There, there we go. Oh, left, 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 left. Oh, I couldn't go left. I didn't have any curve, so I didn't have any control. All right, this is going to be a hard spare to get. Especially when I mess up like that. Let's curve it a little bit and go. Yep, 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 yep. No, I curved it too much. Wait, can that guy do it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get him, penguins. Get him. Damn it, it didn't work. All right, let's go really slow on this one. Really slow for as much control as possible. And I messed it up. Whatever, guys. We got enough pins. Now, we still need to get... Oh, we need to get a strike right here. We're going to get screwed. So let's go all the way here. Hit that and curve i want to curve right but if i curve right i'm gonna fall in there curve a little bit to the right all right oh, oh damn it now you guys may think this is a gutter but there is a way to break out in this game if you spam x you will jump out of the gutter but you have to spam it really fast and damn it i messed it up okay you got to be more careful than me than me but don't worry I'll, I'll get it guys i'll get it and come on come on come on, come on. damn i'm still not doing very good I love how the pins really freak out in this game, but I'm not doing as good as I need to. So, I'll try harder, guys. Don't worry. I'll try harder. Alright. And I didn't jump out in time. Damn it. So, I don't think I'm going to be able to get the power crystal, but don't even worry about that, guys. Just enjoy bowling. In, in, in this bowling game, you also collect coins if you do good, so you also need to do it for collecting coins' sake. And... Oh, I might have been going too fast. I jumped over a lot of pins. All right, let's go a little bit slower. Let's 
curve a little to the right. And let's go. Yeah, there we go. That was clean, guys. That was freaking clean. All right, we're on the last frame now. I don't think I can get to 150, so let's just have fun. Uh, let's go a little to the left. Yeah, a little to the left. Going a little bit slower on this one. That's fine. And... Oh, oh come on, come on. Hit that last pin. Ah, oh, that sucks. It's always number five. If you ever go bowling, it's always number five that screws you. And... All right, all right, all right, all right. Yeah, bam. Look at that. You're done. So, oh, wait. In the 10th frame, if you go bowling, you also get a bonus frame if you get a strike or a spare. Well, if you get a strike, you get two frames. But if you get a spare, you get one. So we have a chance of breaking 150. We just got to do this very carefully. So I'm going to do this. Into this. Into that. And... Come on, come on, game. Come on. 150. That's all I need. Yeah. Is that... Yeah, that's 150, but I didn't hit that last pin, really. 156. We did it. We got the gold trophy. We got the power crystal. I don't know why they're blue. They should be purple. But we got the... Oh, okay. They're purple up there. What the fuck? That's really weird. Okay, so we got the crystal, people. We freaking did... What the hell is this? Is this a soda machine? What, does this give us a power-up or something? Yeah, yeah, no. I've had that happen to me before. Screw those. It happened to me at school before. Oh, but that didn't happen. All right, that was another diorama. If you needed the diorama for heavy metal, there you go, people. Pretty brutal if I, if I don't say so myself. So what we're going to do is we're going to take that power crystal we just got and go give it to Miss Pasadena. Maybe she'll give us a little reward of money. We could always use more money. So there's Crunch. Hey, Crunch, how you doing, bro? I'm going to hit you. All right, Crunch is too strong. I need to find someone weaker. Once I find someone weaker, everything will work out great. What's up, Pasadena? Do you want to spend one power crystal to unlock Pasadena's new vehicle? Sure. Woohoo! Now then there's the prettiest little power crystal I've ever seen. Thanks a bunch, Fuzzy Drawers. This thing is going to be the fastest piece of Texas you've ever seen. What? What the fuck are you? Oh, okay, cool. We got animation for the new yeah. car. Just like in Simpsons. What? That? That piece of shit cost me a crystal? Oh my god. Pasadena, your car sucks. A lot of people in this game have really cool cars, so seeing that one up... Oh, I died. Seeing that one really freaking sucks. Well, what are, you to, what are you to do? So let's go over here, and let's go to the next area. No, I don't have your plutonium. Yeah, if you need to find items, people, they're usually in the area you are going to. And the area we're supposed to go to is... Mystery Island, so let's get the freak in there. Alright, if you're wondering why I have no control, it's because my controls are actually messed up. I'm going to have to unplug my control and plug it back in at the end of this episode. But it's not the end of the episode right now. It's Right now, we're trying to do some platforming. Alright, platform, platform, platform. We have the crystal for this, so let's use it. And unlock Mystery Island. Mystery Island will have a lot more platforming challenges, a lot more things to kill us, and just a lot of fun stuff to do. So let's go do it. Of course, we're back here with Ninja Penguin and Crash on a part of a car. Yeah. Looks like a transformer. Like, that that little piece of the car will transform into a big old car. These penguins remind me of Penta Penguin from all the old Crash games, but I don't think they're actually officially named that. Ahoy, boy. Oh, there's the plutonium. Avast there, ye swabs. Salty adventure awaits ye beyond these cursed portals of doom. I don't know who made this game, but Thank they at least you, had fun Chips. making it. Yes, race fans, a bounty of booty awaits you in this our first race challenge. Uh, Thrill to the terrors of Tiki Turbo. Endure the perplexing pirates of the carburetor. And defeat the insidious delusions of deep sea driving. Master these dangerous tracks and find greater challenge in the battle arena. Where unhinged lunatics compete for trivial prizes. Isn't this exciting, Stu? Oh, heck yeah. You know I'm excited. Get going, Crash, and show me what you got. Heck yeah, we're in the new area, Mystery Island. We got our first track right there. Can we buy clothes? Hey, yo, Crash. Bring 500 points to buy a classic Crash outfit from Park Worker. Yes. All right, let me let me see it. Hey there, look at what we got here now. This you can buy costumes cool. just like in Sin Sin's Hidden Run. Look at that. We have, um... Uh... 
Indiana Crash? Yeah, yeah, Crash Jones. That's who we got right now. Although Crash Jones would work for Osmosis Jones, so we're going to say Indiana Crash. So now that we've got Indiana Crash costume, you know what we're going to do, guys? We're going to end off the episode. I know, it's like, wait, the first race is right there in this racing game. <laughs> you guys thought I was going to show off the races? The racing in this game sucks. I'm just going to show you guys the platforming stuff and the dioramas. But I will see you guys next time. All right, we got the first track in this racing game called Tiki Turbo. I'm probably not going to show you guys what the racing's like in this game. I'm just going to do this. Look at that. We got a little rear view mirror. And we have the ability to fuse with other cars. I'm trying to get to Engine here because Engine is the best fusion in the game. So, Engine, I'm going to be on your back. And I'm going to be shooting some crap. Uh, in this game, you can shoot crap with the X button if uh, your accuracy is pretty good. Look at that. We just got a kill. Uh, your cars get kind of slow when you fuse, but it's okay because you can blow other cars up when you fuse. Or at least it's much easier to do that. So, yeah, it works out. Uh, let's try... What's the square button do? Square, we're going to change guns because the reason I wanted to be with Engine is because he has the strongest gun in the game. It, you need to be able to aim it yourself, but if you aim it yourself correctly, you freaking kill things. So, let's do this. Send out one of our little scouts there. And boom, we got the two-timer. So, who's behind us right now? Oh, we got a lot of people behind us. Let's kill them all. Engine's rockets do the most damage possible. Look at that. It's super easy to get kills in this game. The more kills you get, the more you fill up your boost meter. When you fill up your boost meter to full, bam, you can boost like crazy. Okay, they're shooting stuff at us. Luckily, nobody else seems to be fusing, so this is going to be an easy race for us. Uh, the only oh, there's super broken items like this thing, where it leaves behind a dust cloud, and in that dust cloud, if you touch it, it's instant death. So all of our enemies just died because they touched the dust cloud. Don't know why they did it. Don't know why they even created a weapon like that. It's super broken. Too broken if you ask me. That one is too. So let's just start shooting missiles and stuff and try to get another boost. Oh, there's a cow. And look at that. You throw a cow, it blows up into meat, and you get four kills. That's exactly what we're doing in this game. So we got another cow. Let's throw this one as far back as possible. Uh, you have to adjust for how your car is moving or you'll throw the car, uh, cow completely off the track. Uh, that seemed to work. Oh, crap! Damn it, it's gonna hit us. Yep, that was a heat-seeking missile. Think of them as blue shells. Okay, what? just get out of here, kids. What the fuck? Thanks for the boost. Whenever the enemy catches up, that basically just means that you're gonna be able to escape. It's pretty fun. So I'm just gonna do that, and that lets me get another cow. So now we got this quad cycle. Let's throw this cow out there, and it will get kills, trust me. There's no way it wouldn't in this game. This game, the racing is too bad. Well, it's too sad that the racing is bad because it has some cool ideas in it. The only problem is all the weapons are unbalanced, so you can do crazy shit like this and win the game. If you fuse with engine when you play this game, you are guaranteed to win. It is the greatest weapon in the game. So I'm going to go back to my Wampa weapon so that I'm not too OP. I'm going to throw a cow at that missile. I did not hit that missile. So since I didn't hit that missile, I'm already dead. Uh, gotta see who's coming at us. You're coming at us. You're dead. Good, good try. Uh, we're coming up to the end of the race, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna unfuse and fuck you, engine. We win the race. <laughs> that is racing in this game, people. That is why I don't plan on showing it. I showed this race just to show you guys how dumb and easy they are. And if you want, really want to watch me get 24 kills doing absolutely nothing, not even racing, all I did was shoot people then I'll do it. But if you guys understand that I think this game is the bad, or the, this game has bad racing, and that there's no reason to show the racing, it's more fun just to show the platforming, the gags, and the mini games like bowling, then, you know, tell me if that's what you're into. But that'll be the end. Thank you guys for watching, and...